The port of Dover will collapse on day one. The supermarkets in Cornwall and Scotland will run out of food within a couple of days and hospitals will run out of medicines within two weeks. At the end of week two, we would be running out of petrol as well. Do you recognise that? You're a Home Secretary, you must I, have seen this document. I have to say, I don't recognise any bit of that at all. And as Home Secretary, as anyone would expect, I'm deeply involved in no-deal preparations, as much as I am, of course, in getting a deal. And by the way, I'm very confident that we'll get a deal, but it's right that we look at no-deal and all these different scenarios. But I don't recognise any of that. Would there be and, any and problem with, with supplies flowing in and out of the so country from, if from there was the no deal? From the work that I've seen and the analysis that's been done, I don't... Those outcomes that you sort of refer to there mm. and they're in the sort of article yeah. more generally, I don't think any of them would come to pass. Because, I mean, if there's no deal, we can keep the border open from our side, but if the French don't, then we are scuppered aren't we? Look, the, the, as we work towards getting a deal, I mean, that's rightly our focus, mm -hmm. but in terms of no deal, you know, it's important for the French and for the Dutch and others that trade continues, even in a no-deal scenario, so they will be making preparations. I have no doubt about that. You sit on all these important committees. Are we going to see, when it comes to the June summit, new, fresh British proposals when it comes to the customs border and all the other really key issues? I think we're going to see good progress. You know, as is as, as, as well known, within government, we've been uh, looking at the different trade options, for example. We've been looking at the sort of uh, the so-called sort of fallback options and things, and there have been good, robust debates on that and I'm absolutely confident as we get to the the uh, June uh, council meeting that the Prime Minister will have a good set of proposals and our colleagues in York will respond positively. New proposals we haven't seen yet? Uh, no, I think the, we'll be focused on what the Prime Minister has already set out in broad terms in her mansion out speech right. and before that and there will also be a white paper from the government before that which I think will help the debate. Home Secretary, thanks very much Thank you for very talking much. to us today. Now look at what's coming up straight after this programme. Join us at 10 from Uxbridge, where we'll be debating the World Cup, not so much the football...